the biggest testosterone boost I've ever seen naturally. In one month's time, we went from 369 nanograms per deciliter up to 919. This was the biggest ramp up I've ever seen. The big thing that I believe that really drove all of this was the mix of ice bathing every single day followed by exercise and not the other way around. The people who are doing ice bath before they do their exercise are getting 25 to 30% performance boost, which is totally different than you know what your high school track coach taught. Do the cold first, the exercise after. And there's some good science showing that your heart doesn't work as hard. Your metabolism doesn't work as hard. Your muscles don't heat up as fast. And you recover faster when you pre-cool your workout. Every day I climb in. That's brutal. And I just get in there for three minutes in the morning and then I work out. That's fucking brutal. Well, because I read this thing, it's about the benefits of cold plunge before you actually work out. Really? Yeah. I'm trying that now, and I've only done it three days in a row. Well, how's it working? It's working. <laughs> it's hard. This is a 66-year-old man in Massachusetts who said, I found your article, I decided I was going to do my cold, I was going to jump in the pond, and then I was going to, like, soccer mom walk home. That's all he does. Just a little bit of light exercise. His testosterone goes up just as high as my aunt. He's 10 years older than me. No exogenous testosterone, no DHEA. Nothing. The basis of the exercise protocol is getting in the ice bath before the exercise happens. Six, eight, ten minutes in there, right into the workout.